Hi, this is Andrew from Bongo IT, and today I'm just going to tell you how to install Link 2013. That is a piece of software that comes with Office 365, and it's very much like Skype, so you can video conference um, your colleagues and get them into online meetings. So I'm just going to open up Google Chrome. What you need to do is go to portal.office.com, and there you're going to sign in using your username and password. And it's going to log you in to your admin page. You might log into your Outlook page if you've got that set as default. Doesn't matter. What you need to do is go to the settings cog over here and go to Office 365 settings. Then on the left hand side, we're going to go to software. And as I say, Link comes with um, the Office, 36, uh, Office 365 Office 2013 software. So that's Word, Excel, PowerPoint, etc. And it also comes with Link here. I'm just going to make sure you got it in the right language. So that's English. And then we're going to click Install. That's going to download this little installer app. And you're going to want to run that app. And click Yes. You do want to allow that app to run on your computer. And I'm going to minimize this window. And that here is uh, starting to install Office, getting things ready for you. You don't have to sit through the whole installation. Office is going to install in the background and very quickly you're going to be able to use some of the, the apps that are available with Office. Uh, you're probably wondering why you might want to use Link. Well, it's very useful for us as um, IT support people means we can quickly get into a conversation with our clients and um, then remotely support them via the app as well because it allows desktop sharing or we can just take a quick look at someone's computer and um, show them how to do something and help them so this will say office is installing in the background you can use your programs now but please don't go offline and don't restart your computer until this is finished Okay, so if you're on Windows 7, you go Start Programs, Office 2013, and find Link. If you're on Windows 8, or so 8.1, like myself, then you can just go for the Windows key into the search bar and look for Link, L-Y-N-C. That's Link 2013. We're going to boot up Link for the first time. That's going to require me to sign in with my sign-in address, andrew at bongoit.co.uk. I've already typed my password into this computer, so but you'll need to do that. And there we go. Logging into Link. It's booting up. You can see that I've already got a list of people that I work with. And a list of other contacts, some of which are our clients. My status is green at the moment. It's set to uh, available. You can change your status if you need to here. There's various statuses available. You can change your photo by clicking on this button. And if you, best thing to do is to add me as a contact. So you click on the little man with a plus symbol. Go to add a contact, not in my organization, because I'm, I'm probably not in your organization. And I'm on link. And then you just type in my address is andrew at bongoit.co.uk and you can add me to your list. I won't add myself to my own list. And uh, that's how to set up and install link. Thank you very much.